from Kansas to Oz. Therefore, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. All things are passed away. Behold, all things are become new. 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17, King James Version. In The Wizard of Oz, an American children's book, a cyclone comes through Kansas and west of Dorothy and her little dog Toto, still in their house to the land of Oz. After a safe landing, Dorothy exits the house only to become acutely aware that things are different. The colors are different. The people are different. The customs and laws are different. And everything is new. Realizing this, she exclaims to her dog, Toto, we're not in Kansas anymore. At that moment, Dorothy knows that her whole life is about to change. Now I know that Dorothy and her experience are entirely fictional. However, one nation in Bible times had a similar experience. God's deliverance of the Hebrews from Egyptian bondage, to me, was a figurative Kansas to Oz experience. The Hebrews have been enslaved about 400 years. At the time of their deliverance, most or all did not know what it was like to be free. All they knew was to do what the Master told them to do, how He told them to do it, and for however long He told them to do it. This was ingrained into their very being. So when God brought the Hebrews out of Egypt, He made it a point to tell them, I am the Lord your God who brought you out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage. Exodus chapter 20 verse 2 In other words, what happened in Egypt doesn't have to happen here. You are no longer slaves. You don't have to do what slaves do. God sends that same message to us today. His words tells us, For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believes in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. John chapter 3, verse 16 Yes, we were born into the bondage of sin. Yet, because of the shed blood of Christ on the cross in our place, God tells each of us, My child, you don't have to be a slave to sin anymore. We no longer have to do what sins tells us to do, when sins tells us to do it, and for however long sin tells us to do it. God has redeemed us from its bondage. When we are in Christ, we are new creatures. So we have a new lifestyle. It's sort of like going from Kansas to us. Carmelita Green So, what do you think about this story? Comment down below and let's share your thoughts.